Good afternoon. I'm Andrew Harrison. We are following breaking news for you. Canton man out on bond for domestic violence charge is accused of kidnapping his ex-girlfriend, driving her all the way to Bogachita before killing her, then killing himself. We've learned the victim is a mother who had a child with the suspect. She was set to graduate from college this December. Right now, here's a live look at the scene where this all ended down in Boca Chitta along I-55. That is in Lincoln County. This is where investigators say the suspect shot and killed the victim before taking his own life. You can see there's still investigators out there on that scene. The traffic on 55 is not being impacted. Now to Canton, where this whole ordeal began. 12 News is Linnea Lewis talked to the victim's mother. Linnea joins us live. Andrew, it's a sad case, like you said, that started actually last week when the suspect, Jamarquise Black, was arrested for domestic violence and aggravated assault. Now, he was able to bond out this past Monday where he was able to get out. And just last night, that's where the family says that uh, the victim, Fiona Ratliff, had got home. Black jumped out the bushes and then kidnapped her. Her sister tried to rescue her, but Black shot her sister in the leg. Now, I spoke exclusively just a few moments ago with the mother about this incident. I went in my job to get me something to drink, and he opened the door, and his facial expression, and I said, he shot her, and he said, yes. And I said, is he dead? <laughs> Some very, very emotional sound there. Now, this morning, authorities were able to ping Black's phone to find their location. But tonight, I will have more information and more details with the mother about her last words with her daughter. Live in Canton, Linnea Lewis, 12 News.